We are finishing up series three of the IT crowd. Uh, what was the title of it? Uh, Calendar Geeks. That is the title of it. Yep. Man, this, I, it just keeps getting funnier and funnier and funnier with each and every one, man. It's just, they're hitting stride right now. Yes. They're yes, hitting they the are. stride. It, uh, this is possibly, they're gonna, and I'll, I'll be straight up honest. Aside from Embrace the Suck 21, I don't look at TV shows anymore. The last binged TV show I've watched was probably Jack Reacher. And that was when it came out in 2022. Yeah. And I didn't watch anything before that. The only thing I watched before Jack Reacher was Parks and Rec. When uh, okay. it came out. Yeah. So there's a long, lot of chunks missing. Yeah. I would say, for me, uh, the last series that I binged was I Think You Should Leave when the third series came out on Netflix. Gotcha. And other than that, like, I'll be upstairs with Nana. She's like, help me find something funny. And I was like, I don't have any recommendations. All my TV watching is here. Yeah. IT Crowd is my shit right now. Yeah, right now, IT Crowd is my top. That is just, I'm, he I'm here at Embrace the Suck 21 for this show. Mm hmm yeah it, it's a pretty damn good job yep. <laughs> but anyway that's not what y'all came here to see we'll no. save that for the podcast 100 <laughs> percent. let's go in three two one okay now oh this is seventh floor yep where all the hotties are <laughs> nearly finished boy yeah taking a very long time it's a very complicated problem you have a lot of chabarangs in your hard drive. I'm sure I'll look at it eventually. Mm. Ugh, frustrating. Come on, work. Work, I do any computer. Nadine, do you know anything about digital cameras? Oh, Roy might. I do, as it happens. I'm an amateur photographer, actually. I just got this new one, but it's really complicated. Oh, that's fixed. What's wrong <laughs> Wasn't turned on. Wasn't turned on. Oh. I don't even know why I got rid of my old one. It was working perfectly fine. Oh, yeah. Well, these all look good. <laughs> What's going on with this fella? Look at him. He's pulling a mad fizz. He looks completely mental. That's Dave, my brother. He's got a very serious condition. Oh. <laughs> when I said mental there, I meant mental in the sense of intelligent. You know, like he's, he's a big reader. He has boss eyedness. Boss eyedness? He's permanently boss eyed. That must be a big pain in the arse. It is, and the terrible thing is, is people think there's actually something funny about this. No! Who could think there's something funny about this? But it's a proper condition, and he, he really suffers. He really. Oh god. Oh, oh no. Just, just give anything if Dave could have a normal life. Oh he know. Emily, are you okay? It's just Dave. Oh poor Dave. <sighs> hey, I've got a great idea. Why don't we all try and do something to raise money for people like Dave? Yeah. You're like oh, oh, we must better think of something. I like like a fun run. That's yeah. a good idea. <laughs> or a nude calendar. <gasps> I would say that's maybe even a better idea than the fun run idea. We could call it the girls of the seventh floor. Oh, yes! Uh oh. Yes. <laughs> it's a very strong team. Roy could be the photographer. I could do the photograph <laughs> because I said I was an amateur photographer. Come on, guys, let's do a brainstorm. I'd really like to be November if that's okay. Can I be April? Yes. Oh, and in October we've got to have a Halloween thing. Oh, yeah. Okay, I was just about to say, Roy oh. fell right into this one, <laughs> but it's a, but but you know it's a hopefully a good thing. I mean, come on, we're only uh, three minutes into this. There's no way this is gonna go good. I I all. already I already predict what's gonna happen. I already predict what's gonna happen. Mm. Can if if I can try, and this is gonna be a bold prediction. To make a prediction? I'm the prediction guy. You're the uh, prediction guy now. Because of the quality, 
there's going to be a nude male one too. <laughs> to balance it out. And uh, I, I didn't count how many were there, there, but I'm sure there was less than 12. And it's going to be uh, Roy, <laughs> at least one, maybe Moss, and <laughs> maybe maybe Jen will get sucked in. Maybe, maybe Douglas is going to try. That's what I'm thinking. Douglas. I'm thinking, oh, my God. All right. Uh, oh, and, God. I, and and I'm, I've learned something from this, that boss eyedness is the term for what we, I guess we call cross eyed. Cross eyed. Yeah. 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 Just With one eye is like yeah. just permanently not straight. Yeah. Or lazy. Yeah. Eye. Lazy eye. That's so when like, one. That's when one is just doing its own fucking thing. That's yeah, when one is just, just fucking not even in the conversation, t- completely disrespecting your line of sight. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, it's like I try to, uh, some of us try to get cross-eyed by like if I look at this one thing for a long time and just look down on it, will I come up? Like I can't do it. I can't do it. What? You just look at the the tip of your nose, dude. That's just it. Just the tip of my nose. With, yeah, just and that's that's it. Just open Do your I eyes hold it wide. here for a couple seconds? No, you just look at the look at the camera. Put your head up and look at the. Yeah, there you go. There you go. There you go. You're cross-eyed <laughs> like that. Uh, like you just walk in. <laughs> yeah. Oh That's god! It. Oh god! That was that was funny as fuck right there. That's just it. <laughs> you know, I have a four year old son. <laughs> you know, I yeah. have to be I have to be good at these things. Yes, you do. Okay, <laughs> let's All move right. on. Boss sideness. This is something which affects one percent of Britons. It doesn't impair eyesight, and yet people with boss eye are routinely discriminated against. <laughs> just like any form of discrimination, it should be stopped. But we can only do so with your help. That's right. We're looking at you. <laughs> it's not funny, Jen. <laughs> it's a very serious condition. I know it is. I know it is. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, this is exactly the kind of discrimination that we are fighting against. And, and what do you need from me? I just need a little time off work. Um, we're trying to raise some money for the boss side. <laughs> Oh, who? Who is? Just me and some people. Oh, yeah, who? Uh, some people from upstairs. You wouldn't know them. Oh, OK, and what are you going to do? Well... Hi! Hi! <laughs> Hiya! What are you talking about? Uh, uh, nothing. I'm just talking to Jen about a private project. What is it? <laughs> it's just, uh, it's just a, a private project I'm doing that's private. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's just a thing. It's just a big, bloody pain in the arse thing that I might do. Oh, you are being modest. It's a very kind thing you're doing. Very generous, very charitable. I really am impressed, you know. Good for you. What's he done? Persuaded all the girls on Seven to do a nude calendar for charity. (laughs) (laughs) Bye! Bye! Oh, God, he's right. Oh, how the hell? No, no, oh, he made it sound sleazy. It is sleazy. Oh, what kind of man would want to photograph a bunch of beautiful women without any clothes on, Roy? The kind of man who wants to help people, Jen. (laughs) No, I don't like it. I find it very offensive. No, it's going to be tasteful. No, it's not. You're right, it's not. It's not. It's going to be rude. It's going to be sexy. All the things that men like, and it's going to make a million quid for that charity. No, 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 absolutely not. Why not? Taking your clothes off. If it's if it's unemployed men or old ladies from Yorkshire, it's fun. If it's sexy women, it's not fun. It's oppression. No, I will not give you any time off for this. Well, OK, well, then, I, I will do it in my own time. Oh, Roy, you're behaving like a horny teenager. No, you are. <laughs> try and have some dignity. No, I won't. I won't. I won't. Sit down. No, I'm not going to sit down. I'm not going to listen to you. No, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it, Jen, and it's for charity, and there's nothing that you can do about it. Try and stop me. You're embarrassing yourself. Roy, stop it. Come back here. Roy, don't be silly. Come back. Roy! I think Jen's a bit jealous that she didn't get invited to well, do this. Well, once, once she gets invited, everything's going to change. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah. It's not oppression after that. It's... Nope. Inclusion. 
It's conclusion. Yeah. Free the nip. Yep. Free the nip. Oh my god, dude. Yeah. Thank you. I'm really pleased we've had this conversation. That's a Any <laughs> Oh god, here we go. Oh, so Hiya. Thank you. Roy, thank God you're here. Jen's just been telling us how the calendar would have been sexist. Oh, has she? How has much she? better if we use old ladies or unemployed men in it? Oh, good. <laughs> she thinks we'll make a lot more money because of the R factor. The R factor? Yeah, the R factor. The thing that makes you go, oh, when you hear about <laughs> it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but will anyone actually want to see old women or destitute men with no clothes on? <laughs> Won't that just make people go, ah, rather than, ah? Oh. <laughs> Guys, I've got a great idea. Why don't we all ask our grands to do the calendar? Oh, Nadine, you were just so full of ideas. But can I... Hold on one second. What's our theme? Isn't our theme girls of the seventh floor? That was a very strong theme. Yes, Roy, but now the theme can be grands of the girls of the seventh floor. Oh, yeah, I don't want to take photos of grannies. <laughs> this, this could do very well, Roy. This could be tasteful, like the one Helen Mirren did. Old ladies, <laughs> hot pants covering their bits, you know the sort of thing. Mm -hmm. An erotic calendar the whole family could enjoy. What? Oh, you can't drop out now. Douglas has already paid for the studio time. What? Has he? Yeah, he's really very interested in this project. <laughs> and I just have to say how I'm just finding this whole thing just so moving, how so many men have come up to me and shown the interest and support for the calendar. I mean, people really do care about the boss sides. <laughs> well, you, you, you can't drop out now. I wasn't wrong about you, was I, Roy? I thought you were special. Uh. I am. I'm so special. I, no, I, let's do it. Let's go round up those grands. <laughs> Thank you. That's OK. So that's what they needed to... <laughs> forward it with is uh he might get a girlfriend out of this there you go man there you go the Ugh. champion of the triers right there yeah i would love to know how douglas was convinced to fund all of this because initially it was a girls of the seventh floor yeah type <laughs> deal which knowing him and knowing his history he'd be all for yeah he's like yes how much doesn't matter yeah God. Oh, man. Hi. Hi. You don't have to do this, you know, Roy. We could just get a proper photographer. Oh, no, I'm happy to do it. Okay. How's it going? Um, not a great start, I have to say. Of all the girls on seven, only nine have grands that are still alive. <laughs> of that nine, one is having a hip replacement on the day of the shoot. <laughs> one is a little... Senile and may not know what's happening. And the last one, the last one has a gangrous arm. But she still wants to do it. So all I have to do now is hit the streets and find six old women that I've never met who would be happy to take all of their clothes off and let me take photographs of them. Why are you doing this? Same reason I do everything, Jen. To have sex with a lady. <laughs> this is gonna be terrible oh like, my god how like i get this is the days before craigslist so yep. how do you even go about getting to be the right type of person to do this kind of thing in this time of air probably a different side of the street Different side of the street. Okay. You know. Yeah. We all know where they are. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yep. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. What? I said, do you want to be in a nude calendar? Do I want a calendar? No, no, no. Do you want to do... A nude calendar. 
for charity. Oh, for charity. Oh, well, in that case, yes, I'll take it. Um, how much is it? No, 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 no. No. Do you want to do a calendar? But the doctor has already changed my catheter. No, no. <laughs> no. I need you to take all your clothes off and have me photographs <laughs> of you. Oh, no. Oh, no. You remembered your own mum's birthday. <laughs> oh, God! Get out of there! I see. Jen! Oh, God. <sighs> I knew something like that would happen. I'm surprised it didn't happen sooner. I mean, one <laughs> granny was beating him up, so... <laughs> he went right to the source. Right to uh, the retirement home. Yeah. Good God. Oh man! Oh, He's my like, God. I've all, my doctor's already replaced my catheter. <laughs> no, do you? Do you? <laughs> oh God! What the fuck? All right. I, I, somehow, I just love old people humor. Like no. it's just, it's just <laughs> we're gonna break your hip. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny to me. I don't know. Why. Oh God. Hi, T. Jen. Hi. <laughs> I just wanted you to know, this calendar doesn't make a million pounds. I'm holding you personally responsible. What? That's not very fair. I'm sad to say that the only secure route to a knighthood in this sorry age is via charity work. You can't do that, Mr. Renham. It wasn't my idea. Nonetheless, the idea came from your department, and as head of the department, it's your nuts on the block. Oh, Mr. Renham, I... Don't worry, Jen. Just make it as sexy as hell, and watch the money pour in. Sexy, sexy, sexy. Every page sexier than the last. Mr. Renan. Oh, grands. Grands aren't sexy. That's not going to make any money. What kind of society are we living in? <laughs> what? Apparently, we're living in the kind of society that sees a man who just wants to take naked photos of some old ladies <laughs> as some sort of weirdo. Who deserves to be chased and shouted at and beaten and chased? Did you tell them it was for the boss sides? Oh, I did. I did. I did tell them that, Jen, and you know what happened? They just laughed at me. What? They just laughed at me, Jen. They don't care about the boss sides. Oh, 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 wait, wait. You know what? Maybe, maybe we should rethink the theme a little bit. Grands of the girls of the seventh floor. It's such a mouthful. Why don't we just bring it back to girls of the seventh floor? You said it was sexist. Oh, pfft. it's empowering. Sexist. How dare you be so patronizing? Oh, no, 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 no. And, and you'd enjoy it, Roy. You'd enjoy it. I mean, yeah, you'd love to take those photos, wouldn't you? You'd enjoy taking those photos. I bet you would. Yeah, you'd enjoy that a lot more. Do you know what I'm talking about? Hey, 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 hey. hey. I don't know, Jen. Oh, come on! No, no, you know, I don't think that Kimberly would like it. And I don't want to make any wrong moves there. I cannot blow this one. Kimberly is the best thing that has ever happened to me. And she hasn't really happened to me yet. We are not going to make any money with grannies. Well, I'm back! <laughs> what? What do you mean? I'm back from holiday. You were on holiday? Yes, I was on holiday. <laughs> Oh, that's yes, right. Yes, 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 yes. You didn't know I was on holiday. No, 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 no. We did. did. Uh, where, where did you? Where did you go? You didn't know I was on holiday. Oh. oh we did. We did. Uh, we, we we missed you. Mm. I've been gone a week. A week. Wow. Ah. Oh. Hmm. What? You know what's very in at the moment. I don't. Geeks. You lot. The whole nerd thing. Geek chic. It's very in. So? So it's a calendar oh. that celebrates scientific achievement. <laughs> That's right. About time. <laughs> Think of it as an opportunity to reenact all of your favorite moments from the history of science. Oh, yes. <laughs> and maths. And maths. Yes. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I mean, that's one way to make it up to your coworker who you're somewhat close with, uh, forgetting that they were on vacation. 
for a week. <laughs> for a week. I mean, uh, I mean, you'd notice if I was gone for a week, right? Yeah, yeah, I would. I yeah, would. But yeah. You know what, I, I, I'm, I have known acquaintances, but that's when I was working at the bank. You know, that's like nine to five. Like it was our business to know everyone's business. Right, you know, right. But I mean, there are times where I'm like, oh, where is she? He's like, oh, she's on vacation. Fuck. And that's my work. Right, know? right. It's either the coworker that you get along with the most or the coworker that you want to uh, and it's do a vacation. stuff with. Oh, yeah. oh, or or the coworker you hate. Or and the then coworker work you hate. becomes amazing. Yeah. That week. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay, are they all there? Yeah. Yeah? So you've rounded up all your best-looking friends? Yep. Okay, great, Roy. Okay, remember, it's got to be sexy. Sexy, sexy, sexy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so... If the rest of you want to take lunch... I'll do moss first. So I'll hold up the beaker like, ah, oh, I've discovered something. Exactly, yes. But what have I discovered? It doesn't matter. I <laughs> think it does a bit, actually. <laughs> um, OK, you have discovered nuclear bombs in a beaker. <laughs> You're right. It's surprising. So give me surprised. Yeah, that's it. And it's, it's confusing. <laughs> yes, you're confused. And you are afraid of the consequences of the discovery. Give me fear. Fear. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay, nice. So, nice. Oppenheimer. And if, if you're hot or anything, Moss, maybe you could undo some buttons on your shirt. No, I'm all right, thanks, Roy. Maybe just undo your top button. Why? It's hot. It's a hot lab because of all the... Fusion. Fission? Fission. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Maybe just one more button. <laughs> okay. That's good. And maybe you could, uh... Maybe you could get down on all fours. <laughs> Why? Because you had some microscopic nuclear things and you drop them. Oh, 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 big clots. Oh, not me. <laughs> yeah. Oh. They're down oh, there somewhere. It's a pain. Oh, where are they? Yeah. Oh, oh, and you're, you're getting angry. Oh, well, I would. Yes, oh, it's because you can't find them. Oh, 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 you know how you growl when you can't oh, find stuff? Oh, that's it. And oh. there are other people in the lab and they're being so noisy. Okay. Shh. That's it. Shh. <laughs> yes. yes. And, and then it occurs to you that maybe you put your microscopic nuclear things in your back pocket. Oh, did I? Oh. Oh. <laughs> why would they be there? And yet I put them there. Yeah. Oh. Oh. It's, it's strange. Yeah, yeah. Oh. You're working hard. You know, oh. you're tired. Oh, well, I've been busy. Yeah, oh, and they're being noisy again. Shush, oh, shush. Yeah. Shush. <laughs> oh, that's good, boss. Yeah. Shush. Okay, so just give me a... A cheeky sort of, I've been a naughty boy, look. <laughs> but I've just solved Fermat's theorem. Yes, but you solved it in a way that the stuffed shirts of the time would have found very naughty. Am I Fermat? Because oh, he's got his shirt off. I am. <laughs> <laughs> Who's solving science with their shirt off? But, uh, what the fuck? That whole part where he got Moss to look sexy. Uh, <laughs> Just, I got. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh, I dude. But then again, to my my question earlier, you know, Rule Thirty Four of the Internet would solve that. So pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> These clothes are wrong. <laughs> It's, it's, you're more. You're you're a naughty mathematician, Roy. You, you you're doing it wrong. The the lighting is all wrong. 
The pictures are going to be very gloomy, Roy. This whole setup is inadequate. It's a celebration. You've just discovered penicillin. Uh, what? What? Why are tops off? I always take my top off when I'm celebrating. Don't you? Oh, yes, yeah, of course. Cool. Is this, this guy right yeah. here? Is he the... My... Oh, who is the documentary guy? My money don't jiggle jiggle, it folds. Is that that guy? Oh, it sounds like it, though. Yeah, yeah. It he has like to it. be. He has to be. Maybe he made a guest appearance or something. I don't oh, know. Oh, my God. Uh. <laughs> Cavort! <laughs> That's it. He is, yeah. His soul is gone. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Thank God for all that penicillin. <laughs> oh, touch each other in the celebratory way. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. Yes. That's good. Oh God. What oh, did we just watch? My God. We we lost him. Try so hard to get this one girl. And he sacrificed his soul. Yeah. There has to become a point where you're just like, I give up. I can't do this anymore. Yeah. Yep. <sighs> mm. We can mm. only do so with your help. That's right. We're looking at you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I just wanted to say a few words. Hey, but, come uh, on. People will see at last that this... <laughs> this is exciting, isn't it? Ready Ministry's first sexy new charity calendar. Come on, Goofy. We want to see the calendar. I can't wait. I hereby announce that speech over and the calendar ready to go. Here we go. And I think I speak for all men here when I say I can't wait to get that box open and feast my eyes upon its sexy contents. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, someone's played an awful prank. There's nothing here but gloomy pictures of morons. No, no not morons, geeks. Um, they're sexy now, you know, geek chic. Geek chic? I want to tear my eyes out. <laughs> this is horrible. Horrible. <laughs> this is your fault. It was Roy's idea. You idiot. I wouldn't buy this, and it's an aid of me. I didn't do it. I'm talking to her. It's hard to tell with your mad eyes. <laughs> Sorry, we're late. Oh, here are the calendars. Brilliant. Oh, oh, great. We're on a calendar. Box fresh. <laughs> there goes the entire audience for our calendar. <laughs> and they got it for free. <laughs> <laughs> I expected that response out of Douglas. Like, yeah, yeah, no, no, no. He did no wrong there. He did no wrong there. All right. He was just like, I, he was misled. All right. Yeah. I mean, yeah, he was misled. He was and misled. that's all it was. He was misled. He did nothing wrong. <laughs> he, he, he funded something that didn't turn out to be that. Yeah, it. What more can you say? Nothing. Nothing. Mm. I'd be furious too if I didn't get my return on investment. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it it wasn't his thing. That's just it's plain and simple. It wasn't his <sighs> thing. Yeah, there There's you nothing go. Nothing wrong with that. There you go. Now, <sighs> but our boy Roy's about to win. I sure Hopefully. hope so. Hopefully. I hope so. Right. I don't care that no one liked the calendar. That was the nicest thing that anyone's ever done for me. Really? Really. Yay! <laughs> the doctor's already changed my calendar. Ah! Boy, what's wrong? Uh, nothing. Uh, no, I'm... Don't let me stop the kissing. Let's... What is going? <laughs> oh. Oh my 
Right, uh, are you okay? Hmm? I'm just tired. Oops. Oh. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Mm. You're doing it wrong. Mm. Cavort! You're, you're doing it wrong. The doctor's already killed by Catherine. You're doing it wrong. You're doing it wrong. What is it? Kimberly! It's not gonna work out. Oh. 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 Oh, man. That probably worked as a massive power move in his failure. In, yeah. In his favor. Because uh, probably no one rejected her. Ever. No, never. And now the geek rejects her? Oh, oh man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're, I'll give you that one. That was a bit of a power move. It's, it's a chess move, even though he's scarred forever. And it has the ultimate anti-Viagra. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but shit. With his inexperience, he probably didn't know that you're supposed to use all those pictures when you're about to arrive, but you don't want to arrive. But no, not his mind. There, he's it, probably not been there, if not he's, ever. He's just a tormented man at this point. Love this, man. I love, absolutely love this episode. It's a great, you just, Series 3 was firing on all cylinders. Hey, this didn't feel like a whole series. Right. It, it felt it short. It went quickly. Yeah. Sign of a great series, if yeah. you ask me. Man. So we got one more series and a Christmas special, man. We're just under three quarters of the way done. <sighs> and I don't want to be done with it. I wish we could go back to the beginning. <laughs> I wish right? we could just delete everything and go back to the beginning. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But, um, man, that's always... It sucks, man. It's, it's, it's actually, like... It's really refreshing. And that's something that the UK... TV series, aside from Poop Show, did right, you know? And I'm not saying Poop Show's bad. I'm just saying, like, the three series and stop is, like, the thing to right. do. Right, right. I mean, Lump Peep Show, obviously haven't seen much of Only Fools and Horses or Still Game or there's another one not going out. But, you know, uh, eventually, in time, we'll get yeah. to those. But, I mean, for the most see... part, they've all been short, right? Father Ted, short, granted, not by choice. But, actually... Sort of by choice too. But it was the perfect timing. It was unfor um, the unfortunate timing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but but then uh you had Black Adder, not yeah. that long. Not Four that series. long. Faulty Towers, not that long. In between there's what three? Four and Four? movies. Yeah. Four oh the movies. I don't really count the movies. I count the movies, but you know, they did it because of the series. They weren't right. like you hear me out on that. I was like just it it was wasn't that long. It's very watchable yeah none of these great iconic uk series have been drawn out and i think that the shortness uh, the, the the speed in which they're over it just it's it's a sign for a great tv show yeah and but we got one more of this one can't wait to get to it and me neither yeah. youtube crowd thanks for uh watching somewhere around to subscribe and watch another video patreon thanks for your patronage keeping the lights on Wash your hands, scrub your toes, wipe your ass, blow your nose, embrace the suck. Unplug and do something epic, guys. See y'all next time. Later. Fellas, we could be that mistake. Let's do this.